Hi, this is Yolan. Um, I just wanted to share this with you. Yesterday, a friend sent me a message and asked me for my secret, why I look younger for my age. I think I look my age. I don't think I look younger. Why? Because I am not doing anything to speed up the aging process. And most people are having a lifestyle in what they do every day that is speeding up the aging process, like eating processed food and having a lot of stress in their lives and they're not sleeping enough and they have certain abusive uh, habits. Uh, I can tell you my secret for looking my age, which some people may think it's, is younger because I'm not part of the norm, the way I eat. If I would show you how I live every day, you would think it's difficult for you, but it's not. Um, it's just a way of life for me to live like this. And it's protecting me and I'm happy and content and I don't have to suffer like all of other people are suffering from insomnia, from pain. And I exercise on a regular basis. I control what I eat. I don't just see food and I put it in my mouth. I, um, what I did uh, really, my secret is uh, for looking my age is really a positive attitude toward life. Everything I eat is on process. I uh, have abstinence from alcohol, coffee and tobacco. I only use shea butter, pure shea butter as a moisturizer on my skin for the past 25 years. I don't use anything else except lipstick and sometimes eyeliner, which is organic, which is something you can eat. I would not put anything on my skin if I cannot eat it. Because when you put anything on your skin, it travels to your pores and it goes straight to your bloodstream. And your immune system and your liver has to deal with it to get it out of the body again. I was not, I can tell you, um, most people are saying, Oh, it's very difficult. No, it's not. It's not. I was not always like this. I used to eat bad food. I used to smoke cigarettes. I used to sleep very late, live on like four hours of sleep. And the result was bags under my eyes, pimples on my skin, and many other ailments, bad health, bad attitude because you know i strongly believe if you have good food you will have good mood at that time when i was a bad girl with bad habits i used to have bad moods because my stomach my digestive system was under stress when your digestive system is under stress, there are nerves that's coming from your digestive system that's connected to your brain. Your brain is also under stress. And my experience is when I overeat, even on the good food, I don't feel good. When I eat okay, I feel good and I sleep good. And a good digestion to me is the key to mental and physical health. 
anyway that is what I wanted to share with you today and um, I'll come back with some more I don't want to say too much not to confuse anyone but try try to recreate your life all I did was recreate my life from something bad to something good where everybody could see the changes everybody could see that I'm different and different in a good way that can set a good example for others I love you and I will always be here anybody who want to message me who want my help I don't accept any money or anything from anyone and I'm willing to help anyone that want to make positive changes in their life but one thing you have to start being tolerant loving forgiving to others and when you do that you will forgive yourself because whatever your thinking is your cells are listening to your thoughts whatever thoughts you have bad or good your cells are listening so that's why I always encourage everyone to be positive bye have a nice day and I'll see you again soon